Hi Gabriella, this is Coach Snow from Sharper Aquatic Image. We're going to take a look today at the four videos of your strokes at the Etobicoke Swim Club Summer Camps. Now each of the videos are in slow motion to give us a chance to look at the details of your strokes and let's find some ways to improve your technique. When we break out off the wall on our butterfly, we have to squeeze our back of our bun, drop the head, a little more streamlined body position. Now I remember talking to you about this on deck. We gotta sort of work on that pitch. Let's drive those fingers down a little bit more. Let's have your hands act as a panel. They're kind of sliding through a little bit. That paddle's gotta dig a little bit deeper. Let's not let the hands slide down so much. You can see the palms of your hands. Let's get the palms facing backwards as opposed to facing down. I like your body position and I really like your kick. At the tail end of your 100 fly or your 200 fly, let's keep that kick working. Good flyers always have the highest hip position. Now I know you're just getting started on this and we do know that we want to kick off this start on our backstroke on our back, not on our belly, right? So your shoulder rotation is good, your bent elbow at the top, it's a good shoulder rotation, but maybe a little snap it a little bit more, right? A little more elbow bend, a little more hand speed on the back of the stroke. Snap that water right to the back wall, right? We're kind of losing the water a little bit uh, towards the back of the stroke. Keep that palm working towards the back of the stroke. Got a good body position and it's a pretty good kick as well, right? Let's go to head back just a little bit more, right? Keep the shoulder snapping. Here's our breast stroke. Again, squeeze the back of the head. So now see if we're looking up a little bit? Keep our head down a little bit there, right? Now look at the way your elbows are driving back, right? We want to try and dig our hands down and let's have our elbows snap under our shoulders. Your elbows are coming right back past your ribs. Let's sort of drive the fingers down, turn the corner and get on top of those wrists, just like we talked about in butterfly, right? When you do your stretch on your kick, Heels up, get your heels up and get into a flat body position. We want to work on maximum distance on our kick. 60% of our power in breast show does come from the kick. We got to make sure we get good distance on that kick. And after we finish that kick, we're going to come right to the surface and get up nice and high and clean on that first stroke. Uh oh, let's not breathe on the first stroke. <clears throat> Off the wall, right? Same as in butterfly, get on top of the wrists pitch those hands down with a nice high elbow catch. You've got an excellent body position and also a good kick, just like your backstroke. All right? Same as a backstroke, let's see a little more hand speed on the very back of the stroke. Right? Snap the hands all the way through a little bit longer. When you're not breathing, keep your head steady and when you go to take your breath, drive that ear to the bottom of the pool. Gabriella, it's been a pleasure. Hope you had a chance to listen to the comments and maybe work on some techniques in your practice. And hopefully we'll see you at a meet this year. All the very best. Bye-bye now.